Ah. Okay. Welcome back to Prince Twilight Princess. Let's go down the waterfall, even though we don't really want to. Oh my god, I can't do it, I can't do it. Ah! It went backwards. So we're basically following this river to end up to the Zora Domain. And don't worry, that's not a death cry. <laughs> You're actually required to do this. That, that's the sound Link actually makes when you fall down a, a deep pit, so yeah. Lake Hylia, yeah, it's back to normal. Uh, are you two awake yet? Look, we got washed all the way down to Lake Hylia, just as I predicted. And it looks like we're right in front of the spring, Spirit Spring to boot. Talk about lucky. Well, let's go. Snap out of it and get to the Spirit. How did you... Uh, uh, whatever. Okay, so this is Lake Hylia's Spirit right here. Lanairu... Lanairu... Uh, how do you pronounce it? I am the last of the spirits of light, consumed by twilight. Hero, chosen one of the gods, you have done well to make it thus far. Gather my sacred tears of light that was stolen by the shadow. Gather them in this. Another Festival of Light! Yay! Okay. I am sure you know by now the forms that these dark insects take when they steal our light. In this shadow realm of twilight, the insects are invisible like the humans of this world. Collect my light. Lift the final cloud of twilight that threatens to cover all of Hyrule. So he basically told us nothing, and he just gave us some more stuff to do. Yay. Best gods ever, don't you think? Don't you think they're the best dang gods that ever done existed in this dang on universe? I tell you what. So, right here, we gotta find more shadow insects. Now, this area of twilight right here is the biggest of them all, so it's going to be very hard to actually find uh, them here because they're f so far scattered. They're not just in this area. Oh, no. They're they're pretty scarce, I will admit. Okay, so there should be one on the edge of the dock right around here. We're going to go to into a battle with more shadow beings or squid faces. Squid beings. Squidlies. Squiggles. I don't know. I don't care. You blocking off another one again? Let me just explore real quick, because you end up doing that anyway. Yeah, you're not clever at all, game. You're not clever at all. It's getting old. And we're just gonna attack you again. Okay. Okay. Now let's get these two together. You know, you two are meant to be together. Come on, attack me. Attack me. Come here. Come here, you two. Come on. Yeah, there you go. Can you move. Come on. There you go. Come on. Come on. Come on. Who's a little alien? Who's a little freak? Who's a little freak? Yeah, you are. Yeah, you're dead. Okay. And there's another warp point for us. So every time those beings actually attack us, we get another warp point. So this actually goes into our favor quite a bit. Okay. So where do we go now? We go over here. Because there is a one right around this area. We're going to have to look for it. Screw you, man. No, I don't care. Are you happy? Are you not so sad? Are you not a sad clown anymore? Customers won't come, even though the water's back. Maybe no one knows. Perhaps I should go tell folks around town. So tired. <sighs> Laziness. The cause of Hyrulean's troubles. Well, that was easy. <laughs> this is like Staples, man. This is like Staples. And come to me, my light. My beautiful light. Okay. So, the rest of them are pretty far scattered. I mean, look at that. We have to go all the way over here and over here. So, let's go back onto the other side of the bridge. I can see better like this. So, yeah. Okay. 
So there's a bit of platforming in order to get this one right here. I figured I'd get this one because it's a little bit closer. Okay, and... Jump on this, right here. You can't actually do most of this unless you're a wolf. Yes, we will be exploring this as a uh, human, as if you couldn't tell. I mean, really. Uh, let's, see. let's see. You're somewhere around here. There you are. Busy digging your own grave, huh? Yeah. You were gonna go underground, but I said no, son. Digging your own grave. Okay. So we gotta go to this one over here. And then we'll be done with uh, Lake Hylia. I think we have to swim all the way over there because it's on its own little island. I mean, like I said before, they put some of these just so far away. Like, I mean, they got some. In, they got one in uh, Hyrule Castle. They got one in Zoro's Domain. I don't think Zoro's Domain. There might be one in Zoro's Domain. I can't remember that well. But if there is, we can usually we can warp there because uh, we got the ability to do that just recently too because we had to fight those shadow beings there. Okay. So, uh, wow, what is that? What is that shiny thing? Oh, uh, it's a Zora. We don't, we don't care what you have to say. You're a fish. You don't know anything. You're stupid because you're a fish. Seriously, you bite my line and bait, and you get, and I, and you become my dinner. I mean, that's how it works. You're just dumb as the all get out. And there's another shadow insect for our collection. Uh, Menda, I, I truly don't care what you have to say right now. I, I truly don't. Okay. So, let's warp to another location. Uh, there's a whole bunch down this river right here, so we're probably gonna have to actually do this. What we're gonna do is actually summon the, uh, bird. That way he'll come up. That way we can ride him down the rest of the Zora River. It's kind of odd that you have to do this, but hey. I mean, really? I mean, really? Come to on, bird. What the heck is that? Is that a bird? No, that's a that's a piece of grass. I'm <laughs> Never mind. It looks like a bird. I just realized that because it has uh, uh, those leaves spawned out like that. Yeah, okay. I never really got a close up of it, and I never really understood why it did that. So yeah, I got it now. It's cool, man. It only took like what five places of this game to understand that. <laughs> Yay! The faceless bird has returned. And yay, we get to ride underneath its belly. That's freaking amazing, man. That's freaking amazing. Okay, so I'm in this wild ride here. We actually have a couple of dark insects along the way. So we're actually going to, in order to collect them, because we can't exactly attack when we have uh, the bird out, we actually have to ram, ram into them. So you see a dark insect over there. If you miss any of them, you can actually go on the ride again in order to hit them. But, uh, right now you really... You can lock onto them. It doesn't really help that much. Oh my god, hit it! Yes! Okay. That's one. We almost died there. That's okay. Mostly you just want to aim... Oh my god, come on, come on. Yes, go in front of me. Go in front of me. And... Come on, hit it! Hit it! For the love of Jesus! That Jesus... For the love of maple syrup, will you please freaking hit the dark insect? It's not going that fast, is it? Is it? Why does it keep disappearing? It's kind of weird. Oh my god! Two for the price of one! Wait, wait was that two? I don't know. I don't care. I just want it. <laughs> nice. And that's all of them. So now we can pretty much just go on the rest of the ride as we normally would. This is what it's like going back up to the um, Zora's Domain. It's actually a pretty nice view, I will admit. Uh, the water right here will actually make you go down lower, so you do want to be aware of that. But most of the time, it doesn't really matter because it's in the most not so annoying places. I don't really know how to say that. <laughs> okay, so we're gonna go above the rock, and hopefully Link won't get hit. I think if you just hit Link on a rock or something, uh, Link by himself will fall, and the bird will be all right. But yeah, you just still don't want Link to get hit because I mean, you are Link for Pete's sake. You're Chain Link. Okay, and let's go up. Bye bye birdie, bye bye birdie, bye bye. Okay. So you can see right here that there's actually a dark insect around here, so we're gonna use our senses. Uh, what do you got to say? Okay, bugs. Yeah, you got you got bugs. I see. What? That? What's what's that? A bug? Ew! Nasty. Why is it so big? Golly, I'm sick of roughing it in the boonies. 
Do the boondocks. Hey, look, it killed itself. Isn't that amazing? Oh, let's hear what you have to say now. Huh? It's gone? That was nasty. I hope it doesn't come back. I killed it! How is it gonna come back? Ah, uh, well. Golly, work is tanking these hard as my personal life these days. I, I did not say that right, even in the most common of senses. Okay. So, we have over half of the spirits that we actually need. I think if we go over here, there might be a little bit of something for us. Right? Yeah, there's a Howling Stone up there. Yeah, we definitely want to use this baby. This bad boy. Come on. Oh, there are two Zoros over there. But nobody gives a crap about them. I don't know why they just did that. So, we're going to use our technique and go up and down, up and down, up and down. Because I like doing that. That helps me reveal the gauge. That way, you don't aren't stuck here doing random crap. Okay, so... Okay, so this is where the wolf is right now, and then we can go see him. I just love those songs. I love those songs. Like, <laughs> okay, so let's go see what that business was with all those Zoros up there. It couldn't be that important. I mean, really. Hey. Eh, you think Prince Rael's passed through here? Yeah. Yeah. This is the only railway that connects to Hyrule Castle. Come on, let's follow this path in search of him. I don't know why I gave him that oxen, but I guess I did because. That's the way he talks when I first heard him. I look at him swim, they look weird. They look weird as hell. Seriously. They have human-like bodies. Humanoid bodies, yet they swim like that? What the frig, man? Okay, so I guess we ought to follow him just to see where the hell it leads to. I think they said Hyrule Castle or something. Yeah, let's go. Let's go! And look at that, we're in Hyrule Field. Amazing, is it not? Is it not? I think it is. There's a rock under there. I don't think that serves any purpose whatsoever. Come on, Link. Lunk. Come on. Thank you. Okay. So, let's go ahead and check our map, because we need to fi No. One. Darn you. I need to get a whole bunch up here in the Zora Domain. I have to warp up there again. But for now, since we're on this path right here, let's go ahead and go to uh, Castletown, just because... Wait, there's another place, right? There's one... No, there... Okay. I thought I saw one right, right around here. I guess that was my uh, pointer. So we might as well go to Castletown since we're on that route right now. Uh, let's go ahead and go this way. Go on across the bridge. Where everything's trying to kill me right now. I love how time freaking freezes when you're using a map. But I wish life were like that. Like if you're using a map and then time would just freeze. That would be amazing, man. That would just freaking be amazing. <laughs> okay. So, yeah, we're slowly going to trek over there. It's too bad we can't use Epona to actually go over there, but then again, we are in Twilight, and then it become a spirit horse, and that would be kind of a ripoff of another TV show, so we can't exactly do that. Uh, let's go ahead and ram you just because we can. So, how many tiers of light do we have? We have about uh, nine, I believe. Yeah, one, two, three, four, five. Yeah, we have nine. Okay. And we have seven more to go. They're mostly in the uh, upper Zora domain, so we're going to really have to pay close attention for that. Why did they put this insect out in the middle of nowhere? I don't know why, because it's really annoying. I don't know why they just put this one randomly over here. Um, there's the wolf right there. We have to talk to him when uh, the twilight's all gone and warp there. We'll just go... Ah, oh, crap! Freaking turn in the butt! Freaking turn in the butt! 
Come on, give me my new warp point. Checkpoint. And yay, you're gonna die because I told you to. Num 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 num. I probably could have done this in a different way, but I don't I don't know. I was kind of already here, so I got I just decided to do this. Um Where's the other one? No, seriously, where's the other one? I don't see him. Where is the other one? I know there's you. Where oh there you are. You're you're hiding in the corner, you silly. Okay, come here. Come on, you know you want me. You can't resist this. I'm too tasty. Okay. And you're dead, squid face. Goodbye, squid face. Spontaneous combust. And then go back into the portal. And recreate another war point for me. And we're all good. Okay. So now, without all that done, we're going to go back into uh, Castle Town. That way we can go get the bug. Yeah, we're going to get the flu in Castle Town because there's so many goddamn people. It's amazing, isn't it? It's, it's amazing. We're going all the way over here just to catch the flu. Okay. Uh, just, we didn't actually trek this way through here, but we're actually going to do that a little bit later. We are actually going to uh, be coming here right after we complete the third temple. And yes, there will be a third temple. I mean, really, they, would, they wouldn't just make two temples. Seriously. Okay. So it's down here in this dark alley. Pretty inconspicuous place, I must say, in one of these boxes. So there you go. And it just zapped me. It's like Zap's potato chips, man. Okay. And you're dead. Give me the lights. Let me lights. Chase my tail. Chase my tail. Chase my tail. Chase my tail. Okay. So, Minda, please warp us to the Upper Zora domain. Right here. Thank you, Minda. You have served your purpose quite well. No, not really, because you're annoying and you tell me what to do and you treat me like trash. Treat me like trash. Swear to God. Don't like it. Okay, so there actually is a dark insect in this place right here. Uh, where are you? Where are you, my precious? The map is showing that it should be right here. Is it on a wall? Yep, it was on a wall. Go fig. Okay, there you are. There you are. There you aren't. Aww. There you aren't. <laughs> Come here, my light source. My precious. Okay. So now with that done, there's four more to get all the way down there at the bottom, so we have to fall down the waterfall again. <coughs> I don't want to fall down the waterfall. Seriously, I'm afraid. I'm scared, Mommy. Okay, let's go on this side because I believe there's actually... Well, we can't, can we? Nope, I screwed myself. What a way to go. Well, no, Lunk! Lunk! No! Oh. Okay. So on these pads right here, there should be two. Oh, there's one in the water. I don't know how I was supposed to attack that, but whatever. Uh, no, get on the land. Get on the lunk. How he just flew up when I attacked him. Like, like he dodged it. That was that was wrong. That was wrong, man. That, that was that was wrong. Okay, you're dead. And why are you not dead? Why you no die? You die now. You die. You no die. Seriously. Konnichiwa, die. What the hell am I standing on? What are these things? They're like... Lily pads, but they're not. They're like some kind of... I don't know, they have roots under them and everything. It's kind of creepy. I hate that you keep going in the water. That's the only thing that's pissing me off right now. Okay. I thought he knocked my senses out, so... There you are. Come on! Oh, come! Why is his attack stronger than mine? That makes no sense whatsoever. Okay, come on, you... Thank you! Jeez. I like how he flew all the way in the water. That was amazing. Uh... Where's... Where's my... Where's my light? Where'd the light go? No, serious... Oh, there it is. I was like... Like, what? I can't dive. I can't go under the water. That's... What? <laughs> but no, it kind of worked out in the best for the best, didn't it? Okay. So, now that we've done that, we're going to go over here, and there should be one against this wall over here, right? Uh, there are levels in this place, so you actually have to climb up. Hey, we climb up from here. No crap, didn't I just explain that? What it goes? Redundancy. What are you, the new Navi? I think not, Midna. You cannot compare to the epicness and redundancy of Navi. Okay. So, whoa, 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 whoa. Do not want to start over. Please do not start over, Link. I do not want to start over. <laughs> um, can we jump up here? No. Wow, way to go. Waste of time. 
I tend to do that a lot. Oh, well, that's not a bad drop, so whatever. What am I complaining about? What am I freaking out about? I don't know. I'm probably going to make this a longer episode due to the fact that I just want to get all the uh, insects in here. So it'll be a little bit easier. Uh, let's see. It's, uh, it should be around here, right? Oh, there's rupees. We can open a chest. <laughs> I like the way he opens the chest. He puts his paw in there. He's like, like a little dog or something. Okay, so there should be one right here. Oh, cool. You're a lot easier to take out than your brothers. Let me tell you that much. Jeez. Maybe it's your mom and dad. I don't know. But it, they were related to you. I know that much because you're all the same. No, I just I just wanted to see Midnight. I just wanted to see. Uh, it should be up there. How do I get up there? Okay, let's go around this way, I suppose? I'm gonna figure out how to get up there. I will figure it out. It's I brilliant. And there's a chest right here. With booty! Ten rupees! Okay, and there's a box right here. I don't know what I'm supposed to do with that. Nothing, probably. Okay. So, let's see where we need to go in order to go up higher, because it's... It's not exactly the clearest of directions right here. I take it I need to go all the way over there, that way I can, uh, progress on. What's with that shiny rock over there? The heck? Why is it so shiny? I take it we'll be seeing more of that shiny rock later on. <laughs> yeah, there's nothing odd about that. Ah, oh, come on, Link! Okay, now, we are going to keep going higher, because there's no going down in tears. You know, there's no, there's no back, there's no back way, um, can I jump anywhere from here? It looks like I can, because it's bulging out and everything, it just looks so odd and ominous, I don't know. Uh, I guess we just keep going up, right? Oh, I probably missed this jump, am I right? I probably did. Yeah, okay, and you just keep going up this way, right? Yeah, okay, this is what I missed. And you'll notice that we actually have two vessels of light incompleted, but there's only one left, so that's kind of an odd sign, huh? You'll see why in a second. Stay tuned for more Legend of Zelda Twilight Princess. No, we're not leaving just yet. I'm going to collect! I'm going to collect it. I'm going to cut until I get back up there. Okay, I'm back up here, and this time we're going to cross it the way we should have. Okay, we crossed it. We did that. We did good last time, Master. We did good this time. No, I don't like calling you my master, so why am I calling you master? Okay, so we pretty much got a leap of faith right here, and we hope we land on there like that. Okay. And this is the last one right here. Except it's not the last one, which is kind of odd, right? So let's get this vessel of light and be almost done, because there's no more. What do we do now? What you got for me, Minda? Hey, what's going on? <gasps> the map's opening by itself! What the hell? There should be one more. Where did that last one be? Power. What? Power. There it is. Uh, what's going on? This is weird. Yeah. No, yeah, I know. The map opening by itself is just freaking weird, man. Freaking weird. <laughs>